we wake Hear the birds and see the sun Side by side our fears are done Well, good morning folks, welcome back to the channel Something a little bit different today So, uh, we're finally starting to uh, move along with the uh, monkey camper van build I've got a lot of cleaning to do in here today to move all these panels and uh, get them out. I've decided to keep the floor purely because it's a really good floor and I don't want to rip it up and it's just an expense that I can't afford to replace it. When this floor was put in it must have been a really expensive floor to put in so I'm going to do my best just to keep that and uh, ideally yes I should lift it and yes I should insulate it underneath. Um, the garage part I'm just going to leave as the non-slip floor the living area I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put a layer of insulated um, padding over the top of this floor before I line it you let me know in the comments below do you think that'll work purely because I don't want to lift this floor uh, I've decided to keep the bulkhead yet again um, purely because I don't want to um, have the expense of putting swivel seats in and everything else. I think it'd be quite nice to keep the two separate. I might cut a hole. So the kitchen's gonna go this end. And I pretty much, I might just cut a hatch out there so we can see through to the cab. Predominantly most of it's gonna be, um, most of it's gonna be hidden by um, the kitchen unit, which I've got here. So yeah, as you can see, that is gonna be my kitchen. I actually found this on Facebook Marketplace. For me, I'll make a decent kitchen out of that. I'll put a sink in it. It's got cupboards, it's got drawers. Thank you very much. Like I say, this is a shoestring build. Um, I obviously want it as comfortable and as good as possible. Solar panels have arrived. The electric fan has arrived. That'll be another video. Facebook scam page for free. Um, that thing does my head in. Um, yes, you do find the odd bargain on there because I found this van on there and I found this cupboard on there and I found this bed. But 95% of the shit on there is a scam, I'm telling you. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to do today. I'm going to crack on now. I'm going to get these panels off, see what's behind it, see what sort of mess. And it was a carpenter's van before. Clean it all out. I've got some uh, sound deadening pads. That'll be today's job. I'm going to crack on and I'll bring you back. When we wake Hear the birds and see the sun Side by side our fears are done All the good times just begun oh, we Well, I'm not gonna lie That was a graft, I gotta say And uh, as you can see, even though I said I wasn't going to take the bulkhead out. In the end, I decided that, you know what, if you're going to do something, get it all out. And I couldn't believe how heavy that bulkhead was. Damn, it was heavy. So I'm glad I took it out. And uh, I am going to build half a bulkhead back in, purely for the kitchen, um, leaving the top half open. Uh, nice set of curtains. It means we've got an escape if we need to uh, back into the cab. At any point, especially as there's deadlocks on here. I've already locked my keys in here once. Yeah, these keys. And uh, luckily, uh, the guy who bought the van off had a spare pair that he'd put in the uh, all the gubbins that came with the van. And that's the only way I managed to get back in. Uh, so yeah, so the bulkhead's staying out. Um, this all needs tidying up, obviously. I am going to leave the floor in. I know, I know, most of you are going, don't leave the floor in there, get the floor out, but it's such a good floor. And uh, money-wise, I just can't afford to rip it up to replace it. It really is a shoestring budget, and I would like to be using this van at some point this year. And the floor is a bloody good floor. Um, yes, the garage area, I'll get a repaint. I'm going to um, pretty much over the top of this floor, I'm, I'm going to... Uh, put some insulation down and then the lino on top um, and for me you know that's good enough I did find a hole in the floor but you know what 
it's no real drama because as it happens I've got a feeling that will be exactly where the night heat is going to go so if anything it saved me cutting a hole in the floor in the first place so uh, hopefully <laughs> there'll be a night heat of covering that up and I can patch the other side up um, if need be I've got to say it's looking cleaner I've uh, put some armour right on all the little bits that have uh, uh, shown a sign of rust or been scuffed um, still a little bit more to do obviously the next thing is to get the wiring in insulation and the solar panel kit I've got a really good uh, a really good buy on the solar panel kit um, that's to go on the roof like I say I've got an electric fan it's not a max fan I wish it was a max air fan just haven't got the budget for that um, so I've gone for a Chinese knockoff it comes with remote control does everything the max air fan does that will go in there nicely uh, obviously the kitchen that all needs repainting, sanding down, redoing, but that is going to be the kitchen unit, put a sink in it. Um, nice tall double bed, and underneath, two monkey bikes. Oh yes, you heard me right, two monkey bikes, because this is the monkey camper. And uh, yeah, she's coming on lovely. Um, other things that I've done, obviously so far, um, I've spent £2,200 on this van. It cost me £1,200 to buy. Then I spent another thousand pound on it. I've had the cam belt done, the water pump, the fan belt, the fan belt pulleys, and it's had a new clutch in it. Luckily, it didn't need um, a master flywheel because it don't have one. It's the last of the solids, and it's got a solid flywheel in it. Um, and luckily, the money I got back for the master flywheel is what I spent on the solar panels. And uh, so yeah, so the next thing is to start wiring and insulating, and. Uh, We'll see where we go from there, but you know, I put my hands up, this is all new to me, I'm uh, jack of all trades, master of none, you're welcome to put in the comments if there's anything that uh, could make my life easier or I should be doing different, um, obviously I know the first thing you're all going to say is, rip the floor up, but I'm not going to, um, and I'm adamant about that, it's not going to happen. And that, do you know what, she's a good solid van, and uh, I think we'll make plenty of memories in her. So, yeah, that's me out of here. Live your best life. Till the next time, I'm out of here.